Hey, what's going on everybody? It's JJ here. You guys wanted to learn some really cool coin tricks, so here's another one for you. All right, normal coin. I know I gotta say that because people are thinking it's a fake coin. All right, check this out, ready? Probably, oh, you don't believe me. No, it's over here, I'm just playing. Actually, check this out, coin, watch it fuse right from the pocket, ready? It's right here. You can actually pull it right through the material like that. Pretty crazy, huh? Actually, on the coin, if you don't, if you probably can't see it, there's always a secret button where you can actually find the middle and pull two apart like that. Cool, huh? Hey, what's going on? All right, this is the explanation uh, for this really cool coin trick. Once again, it's a coin trick you can do on the street, um, impromptu, uh, at a party, um, at the your coolest bowling alley around. So just whatever you want to do. Um, all right, so this is what you need. You need a coin. Um, I'm just using a 20 cent Australian piece and you need another one, okay? This is the setup. You need a pockets for this. Uh, place one of the coins inside uh, your pocket, right or left, and that goes right there, okay? Make sure there's nothing else inside your pocket. It makes it a lot easier just to have the coin inside your pocket, okay? Next part is you, um, I start off with a gag. I uh, always let the spectator feel the coin, make sure it's real, especially when you're telling them you're doing a magic trick. There's that kind of, um, they put that kind of, how do you send it, that kind of shield on, thinking you're gonna use fake props. You know, people think that if you say you're a magician. So I always let them use the coin. Um, hence, you could also even get them to give you a coin, which is always the best thing. So ask them to give you a coin. Remember, you need a duplicate, a double of the same coin. One in your pocket. Then you say, hey, check this out. Check this coin trick out. Um, what you're doing here is you're doing a fake take and you're pretty much having the coin in your hand, pretending to take the coin, okay? As you focus all your attention on here, you just close your hand like this, no one's watching this hand, then you go watch, I'm gonna make it disappear, and you blow on the coin, and as you blow on the coin, you're gonna do the old gut gag with your, you know, the tongue to the side, you go, <laughs> and that's a funny gag, and you know, people laugh. Um, you go, I'm just playing the coins over here. So once again here, you go, I wanna make it disappear. And once, see how I focus all the attention on this hand here, not this hand here, so. I'm gonna make it disappear. Over there. Oh, nah, I'm just playing, it's over here. Then what you do is you do the fake take again, okay? Focus all your attention, um, and you say, look, I'm gonna place the coin right in my pocket, and keep your hand in this position. Like, if you're really gonna take the coin, it would be like this, okay? It wouldn't be like this, um, it would be like this. So you've done the gag. <laughs> nah, I'm just playing, it's over here. Watch, I'm gonna take the coin. See, it's over here now, place it in my pocket. Now what you're doing is you're placing the coin in your pocket, and your right hand, or wherever your, um, your pocket is, left or right, you're placing your hand all the way down and you're grabbing the coin from the bottom, okay? You're grabbing the coin, which is in here. Um, as you go across and you say, watch, the coin is going to go from my pocket, um, it's gonna fuse the pocket, it's gonna go through the material. So what you're doing is you're just pretty much holding the coin here, wiggling it to your fingertips and pretty much just pulling the coin out and pinching it out. Now you're gonna to have to practice this a few times to make it look natural, but it's not that hard. So um, once again, I'm gonna take the coin, place it in my pocket, watch it's gonna fuse through the material. And as you're doing the move here, as this, as all their focus is on the coin here, you're grabbing the coin, okay? You bring it up here, you're grabbing the coin from your right hand and just holding it in your hand, okay? Then you go, I don't know if you notice this, and this is a cool thing. If you want, this is called finger palm position in the magic world. Um, you're just holding the coin like that within your fingers. It's pretty hard to do holding it like this. But what you can do is you can point at someone and it gives the illusion there's nothing else in my hand. That's a bit technical for you guys, technical guys out there. Um, otherwise you can just hold the coin. You go watch closely. I don't know if you know this, see how I'm pointing, but I've got the coin here, I'm just pointing it. There's always a spot here that you can always make. And as you sort of turn your hand around, put the two coins together and you can blow and then produce two. Now that, was, that wasn't that smooth. But once again, do this. There's always a spot here where you can always produce two, just like that. Okay, quickly from the beginning now, coin in here. They pass you the coin, it's a real coin. You go watch this really closely. I'm gonna make the coin disappear. I'm just playing it, it's over here. Actually watch really close. I'm gonna take the coin, um, place it in my pocket and watch it fuse through the material, just like that. Isn't that crazy? Actually, there's always a spot in the coin. I don't know if you know, there's always a spot you can actually double your money or make money or produce money or whatever you want to do. So anyway, guys, practice this trick. Uh, go perform it for your friends. Um, once again, you have to go learn some cool new illusions like this one. Go to my website, freemagiclive.com. That's right, www.freemagiclive.com. See you guys soon.